Hi guys, in a previous video we had seen how to display the records with unbounded connection in data grid view control. And here we will see when a particular row of a grid view we will select the records should be shown in a particular text box. So here I am going to stop my application, move to data grid view, open its properties and from the events you need to fire cell click event of data grid view so double click here so it will be there now you need to write if e dot row index is greater than 0 it means e is a data grid view cell event argument object so data grid view found any row then it will move to this if condition then we will create a object of data grid view row create the object of data grid view row equals to this means a current data grid view dot rows of row index it will check and store the all the rows in a row object and now we will store the value to a particular text box my text box name is txt e name dot text equals to row dot cells of 1 here I'm going to start with the 1 because in a 0th index there is a ID and I don't want to display the ID to the text box dot value and we need to convert it in a string that's why we will use a method dot to string save it and run this I'm going to select a particular row so the name will be displayed to a text box same way I want to display a mobile number and address so I will continue with txt mobile dot text equals to row dot cells of 2 dot value dot to string and same with the address dot text equals to row dot cells of 3 Now run this. Going to select a particular row so all the records from a grid view control to the text box will be displayed. Now it will be very easy to update and delete the records from the SQL Server table. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, please subscribe my channel.